Part 19. Convert between common fractions and decimals. You will find this on page 47 in the Namibia Mathematics Grade 8 textbook Y equals MX plus C to success. To convert a decimal to a fraction or to convert a fraction to a decimal, you can just remember this table. If you want to go from a vulgar or common fraction to a decimal, you can just use a calculator. Just press 1, divide 8, and your calculator will display 0 0.125. If you want to go back to a vulgar or common fraction, you can remember this method. If, the, if there is one decimal place, one digit after the decimal point, you can just take that digit and put it over 10. If there's two decimal places, two digits after the decimal point, then you take that digits and you put it over 100. And if there's three decimal places, you take that three digits after the decimal point and you put it over 1,000. And if there's four decimal places, what will you do? You will just put that four digits over 10,000. But you cannot just leave the fractions like this. You must simplify the fractions. Now, let me show you. If you have 2 over 10, you can simplify it in two ways. You can do it manually by looking for a number that divides into 2 that also divides into 10. So I just divide by 2. 2 will go into both. And I will get 1 over 5, the simplest form. But I can also use my calculator. I press 2. I press A, B, C. I press 10. And I press equal. And my calculator will display 1 slash 5, which is actually just meaning 1 over 5. If I have two decimal places, that was the 45 over 100, I can divide by 5, and I can divide by 5. And I will just get 9 over 20. But if I want to use my calculator, I can press 45, then press the A, B, C key, then press 100, and then press equal. And my calculator will display 9 slash 20, which is actually just meaning 9 over 20. And if I want to simplify this 2, 4, 5 over 1,000, again, I can divide by 5, and I can divide by 5. And I will get 49 over 200. Or use my calculator. Press 2, 4, 5. Press the A, B, C key. Press 1,000. And press equal. And my calculator will display 49. Which is actually just 49 over 200. Let's look at an example. Let's just move it up a little bit. Express minus 2 and 3 over 5 as a decimal. Now, there's two ways of doing it. The first thing, just carry that negative 2 to this side. So just rewrite the negative. Now I can press on my calculator 2 plus bracket. 3 divide 5 close the bracket equal. And my calculator will display 2.6. Or I can first do the fraction part. I say 3 divided by 5 equals plus 2, and that will also give me 2.6. Number B, express the decimal as a fraction. Now, the negative 7, just rewrite the negative 7. Now, look, there is 4 digits after the decimal point. So I take that 4 digits and I put it over 10,000. And I think the best will just be to use your calculator. So press 8755 ABC 10,000 equal, and your calculator will display 1751 over 2,000. And that will be your vulgar fraction. Okay, let's look at an example. Let, you can do the following example for me. Do for me, try now 20, number A and B. Stop the video, and as soon as you are finished, you can continue with the video. 
Oké. Okay. Let's look at number A. Express negative 15 in 7 over 8 as a decimal. So, negative 15 and 7 over 8. Oké. Okay. Just rewrite the negative. Now you can press on your calculator. 15 plus bracket 7 divide 8 close the bracket equal. And your calculator will display 15.875. Or you can first press in the fraction part. 7 divide by 8 equal plus 15. And it will also give you the same answer. Now. Let's look at number B. Express the decimal as a fraction. So it's negative 10.35. So rewrite the negative 10, and then it's just that two digits over 100. But you must simplify it. So you can divide by 5, divide by 5, and my answer will be negative 10 and 7 over 20. Or you can press 35 ABC 100 equals, and it will also give you 7 over 20.